In addition to the mayoral election, several city council races were also voted on today in District 2. Brantley Lyons left that seat open. Julie Beard has won the seat outright with five of six precincts reporting. Beard has 58 percent of the vote over Marquetta Johnson, Richard Williams and Eric Satcher. We spoke to Beard after the win. Looking forward to the most to make sure that there's a difference in every single neighborhood, whether you're in North Pass all the way to Del Rey, Morning View, all the way out West Ferry Road. I want to make sure every neighborhood knows that I care about them and I'm going to represent them. And it's an honor to have this position. Now to District 3. It was a one on one race here with the incumbent Marche Johnson and Patricia June. As you see, Johnson won handily tonight with 73% of the vote. In City Council District 4, there were five candidates in the race with provisional ballots still to be counted. Kalia Bell will face Franetta Riley in a runoff, both receiving more votes than the incumbent Audrey Graham. Terrence Dawson and Oscar Boykin Jr. finished in fourth and fifth place. In District 5, the incumbent and City Council President Pro Tem CeCe Calhoun has also been reelected tonight with a large margin. Calhoun with more than 75 percent of the vote against his sole challenger, Andre Ruffin. Despite a crowded five candidate race, we can announce Andrew Zemanski will be the next council member representing District 7. He won just over 55 percent of all ballots cast, beating out Christopher Christopher Turner, Jamel Brown, George Childress, Charles Dillahay, and Christopher Turner. Zemanski <laughs> already knows his next step. The first thing I want to do is go back to all the communities and make sure that I've heard from everybody the input about the things that matter the most to them, and then uh, prepare myself, make sure I've done all my homework and studied as much as I can to make sure that I can be the best, uh, most competent candidate. It's the, what District 7 deserves. Two more city council races to go. We'll start in District 8 and incumbent council member Glenn Pruitt, a longtime council member in Montgomery who easily won re-election tonight with two thirds of the 4,500 votes cast for him and challengers Terrell Anderson and Johnny Cotton with about 32% of the vote together. Right now, Montgomery City Council District 9 is separated by just 133 votes. Longtime incumbent council member and city council president Charles Genright is leading Darlene Skyer. Again, provisional ballots still must be counted to see if they could determine a change if possible.